click subscribe for update video every day. AMD's perpetual uphill battle has, in recent years, turned into a straight vertical climb. Though still producing new chips, the company's desktop and laptop processors have been continually thrashed in both reviews and on the market. To say the fight isn't fair would be an understatement that hasn't kept AMD from trying. However, and the company does have a clear vision for its future, by promoting a balance of processor and graphics performance, along with new low-power, low-cost processors. It hopes to build system that offer a more complete experience than Intel. This is as relevant to gaming as it is mobility, because games tend to tax both the CPU and GPU. If one falls behind, overall performance may not meet expectations. Enter the MSI GX70. This gaming laptop packs a quad-core AMD A10-5750M processor and a Radeon 8970M. The company's second most popular mobile graphics solution, yet sells for just $1.300, and can be had for a tad less if you hunt for a deal. That's $100 less than an Asus G750, a laptop we think to be among the best values in gaming. At first glance, then, it seems the GX70 is well positioned. But is the hardware really fast enough for hardcore gamers? The gaming laptop market, like the recent of the laptop market, has taken a turn toward thinner, lighter systems. But MSI didn't get that memo. The massive GX70, with its 17, 3-inch display and 2-inch thick chassis, looks much like any gaming system sold three years ago. Black dominates the exterior and interior, a few LED backlit highlights excluded and even the front lip sits over a half inch above whatever surface the laptop is placed on. Unfortunately, the old school look also means old school build quality. Panel gaps are tight enough, but easy to find, and flex can be found almost anywhere a user might care to touch. The keyboard is particularly floppy, and makes a poor impression compared to systems like the ASUS G750 or Alienware M17X. Other design cues, like the touch-sensitive system function buttons above the keyboard, are functionally fine but feel O-class. While design isn't the GX70's forte, connectivity most certainly is. The system offers three USB 3.0 ports, two USB 2.0, zero ports, VGA, HDMI, DisplayPort, 5, 1 audio, and Ethernet via a killer gaming network adapter. A Blu-ray drive is also part of the deal. Many laptops have branded speakers, but the GX70 has. 